Well, uh, hello, YouTubers and everyone. Yeah. All right. Well, I got my Honda clone right here. Went to go fire it up. Left it outside. Brand new motor. All dirty now. But I'm going to clean this thing up and get it back running. Went to go try and see if it run. Put, uh, sprayed some starting fluid in the carb area. Already took all that off. Got that sent in. The overhead valve. Got my carb right there. Brand new. Gasket. Gasket. Breather hose. Goes in the here on the side there. And the intake that goes on top of here. That thing won't stop trying to fall. We got the exhaust here. As you can see water. Well, got this whole thing taken apart because water's in the motor. As you can see, you got to pull on it hard. So I'm not going. It used to be easy, but now it's hard. But as you can see, there's water up in there in the intake. Not good. So I'm gonna work around with this thing. Already got most of the bolts untightened and all that besides I'm about to take the head off I know I'll have to put a new gasket on I have that so and I got the filter out there sitting in the yard over on the go-kart seat and when I when I uh, get this the head off I'll make another video I'm gonna clean this thing up probably I don't know get the fade off of this figure out something I'm going to take this side cover off because it's not sparking anymore. I figure, well, maybe there's water just on the spark plug. So, I'll clean out the inside of the head. Check the piston, make sure it's all right. Because I pulled it over only twice before. I'm going to do an oil change on it, just to let y'all know. So y'all won't be like, dude, you're going to ruin that motor and all that. No, I'm not. Paid $119 for this thing. I don't want to ruin it. But... Mother Nature had her, took her toll on this, so I'm going to bring it back to life. It's a clone. It should still run. Not even a year old. <laughs> it's about to be, but not yet. Alright, well, peace, y'all. Make another vid in a sec.